Hi folks, my name is Pete. Pete sends you, and I'm a plein air painter in New York City. And plein air, that's a French term. It means air that's not too fancy. Join me as I take in this wondrous city with all of its characters and all its magic. Let's do some painting. Taxi! Okay, so we're on the hunt. We're looking for something good to paint, something that catches the eye, makes us want to stop for a little while and engage with what we're seeing. But there's something more to it than that. And what I want to share with you is not so much the painting process, but something having to do with the energy that gets engaged around creativity. The things you see, the the experiences you have, the people you meet. It's a phenomenal thing being out painting, really being engaged with any creative act. And that to me is what it's really kind of all about. So I hope you enjoy. Here we go. Let's walk. It's a little bit of a cold day. But the skies are actually uh, blue. The sun's out after too many damn days of really grim gray here in New York City. Everybody's depressed. If you talk to anybody, they're down. But not today, we're getting a little bit of sunshine. So today, parked in the Lower East Side. Behind me, that's my location. Well, that's my subject. That's what I'm gonna be working on today. I'll show you what I got now. But here's my picture so far. I've just given a rough idea of the shapes and I'm laying in my shadows. And now I'm gonna be uh, blocking in some more color. Here we go. All right, I, uh, I just gave Pete a fist bump out of nowhere. He was a little surprised and I told him it was for his picture because art could describe how you look at the world without you saying the word to anybody is your depiction of it. And I thank him for drawing this picture. I think it's beautiful. I like colors. <laughs> thank you, Pete. Well, all right, this is what we got so far. Working away at it, but the sun has shifted considerably, so now it's time for a tofu sandwich. Don't mix with paints. Have a good one, guys. Yeah. How's it going? <laughs> you like it? Yeah. All right, my brother. Take care. Yes. Uh, hello. My name is Rafia Diaz. Raised in Little Italy. Born in the Dominican Republic. It's my poem published by Ex Libris. You can buy Amazon.com. And I wanted like to tell you, with determination, you can accomplish anything. So don't let your dream fall. You must grasp it, clasp it, and hold it tight. Summon your power and think tall. Strike it, spike it with all your might. Non lasciare cadere tuo sogno. Non lasciare cadere tuo sogno, mano. Don't let your dream fall. A lot of children stop. Children get mesmerized and it's just so intuitive for them. Every, every child's an artist and I always make a point of asking them anytime a, a, a kid stops by with a grown up, are you an artist? 
and they almost invariably say yes. So, learn from those kids. Very good. Oh, thank you, sir. How you get Why the, the lies? Why the better than me? Do you, do you think I did it okay? Your handwriting is better than me. Oh, no way. No. Uh, this one is the necklace. You see that? It's too large. Yeah. This, this. What, on this one? No, that one. That one. Because, you see that? Yeah. So you miss a, and then people didn't know how to read. Okay? And, and, and decide. This one? Yeah. You've got to be. This it's got to be more like this. This, 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 this more. This one on the okay. top line. Okay. This one mixed up. Okay. 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 And 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 this one, the middle one. Yeah. You have a little space. You see that? The middle. Yes. This this. Okay. The middle thing right there. Right okay. there. Yeah. yeah. It, no. Okay. Oh, that one. You see that? Yes. And there's in the middle is one. Yeah, little bit. Okay. All right. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Thank you, my friend. Okay. All right. Sometimes you find help in the most generous ways. A woman stopped by and she was looking at the painting and she said it, that it reminded her of her father's artwork in Hong Kong. He was also a painter outside. She saw that I was a little cold and maybe a little hungry, so she went and got me this to fortify myself to finish this painting so it's a pretty sweet world sometimes yeah yeah thank you <laughs> hello you both i hope you have a great day you too all right I think I'm done with the painting for the day and I'm pretty happy with it. But I'm even happier with having had this great, great experience out in the city meeting these phenomenal people. You know, making art out in the world, it's kind of like uh, an invitation. An invitation for people that you've never met to come up and become your friends, share their experiences, get to know them. So I'm grateful for it. And that to me, that's what creativity is all about. So, hope you enjoyed it. I'll see you next time.